Okay, John. so John died. John. Oh, rest in peace, oh, yeah. John. Hello? John? Uh, John's dead right now. Can I take a message? <laughs> What are you doing? <gasps> are you seeing this? What are you doing with your weapon? What? What is he doing? Look! <laughs> what are you doing? What? How is he holding the weapon in his head? That is not what you're supposed to do with your gun. Anyway, everyone, welcome back to uh, Dinosaur Survival, a game that we've been playing for like... What is this? Episode 5? Five weeks? We've been playing this game and we've made almost no progress. So, um, yeah. I don't know what's... I still don't know what's going on. There's a big ankylosaurus. Let's just try it out. Okay, I hope it dies quickly. It's fast. <gasps> it's really fast. Okay, but I can't hide around this because I'm just a small guy. Oh my god. Ooh. Okay, but I'm alive. I'm alive. Don't worry about it. Don't worry. I'm still alive. It's not going to fit. You're not going to fit. It fits? How can it fit through the... the no! Ah! <laughs> oh my god, how? How is that even possible? Uh, the hunger is... This, this, uh, the hunger of this guy. He, he's just hungry forever, always. Just give me food. Please. Okay, there goes another weapon. This is so not worth it. This is so not worth it. This is so not worth all the bullets, all, all the everything. How is he not dead? Look at how many bullets! Okay, I'm dead. Wait, now my hunger bar is super full. Oh, oh, after I ate the stego before I started recording. Okay, let's just not kill the ankylosaurus. Like, because now I have my weapons back? <gasps> okay, you know what? Let's just ignore everything that happened. Pretend that nothing of that happened and just... Just ignore the ankylosaurus completely. Because now my hunger bar is actually fuller. And I think running makes it go down really fast. I think it's the, the the running that makes it go down so fast. So I should probably stop running so much. That's what I... Oh, wait. No, no you don't. Freaking raptor. Okay, so I have concluded that the only thing that I can possibly do now is to try to... F either fight the T-Rex or run past it again. But last time I tried to sneak past it, it ate me, if you remember from last week. Okay, I think, I think it didn't see me. No, 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 no. Do you think if the Ankylosaurus doesn't even die, then the T-Rex is definitely not going to die. It's so big. Okay, so there's the Ankylo and I have successfully avoided it. Unless if it starts charging at me at this point. Do you think I could just go over this mountain? Because the T-Rex is over there. So if I just go over this mountain, I could just sort of avoid. Do you think that will work again? Just like before when I avoided like half of the game <laughs> by going over the mountain. That was an accident though. That was an accident. I didn't know I was skipping half of the game when I did that. Okay, so I'm now on the mountain. The T-Rex is somewhere down there. I don't see it, but I'm just going to skip it like this. I'm just going to walk over this mountain. La 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 la. <gasps> what? Look at those buildings! What? There's buildings over there. There's like a town! A city! Look at that! But I'm not going to make... I think I might... This is a very slippery hill. Oh, and I'm so high! And it is slippery, I don't want to fall, I want to get to that town over there. I cannot believe that I'm actually doing this. <laughs> Look at that, I just skipped the whole T-Rex part of the game. <laughs> Look at this. <gasps> what, wow, there's a big city here. How can there be a giant city and it's overrun by jungle and it's we're only five years in the future. I'm still confused about that, you guys. We're only five years in the future because it kind of feels like we're like a hundred years or more into the future. And the city could be like a very big, like uh, New York City is now taken over by the dinosaurs and all the humans are gone. You know, that's kind of this, what it feels like. Um... That's kind of what it looks like, but we're five years in the future. It said that we were five years in the future, so that doesn't make any sense that there are trees 
here. So it doesn't make it doesn't add up. It just doesn't add up. Are those crocodiles again? Oh, those are crocodiles. Actually, crocodiles died pretty quick quickly, didn't they? Let's try that again because they were. I'm not getting I... across that bridge. Not much left of it. This city. Where are all the people? What happened to it? What? What? Look at that! Okay, police car. <laughs> I like how he's just wearing a hat. He's a skeleton with just a hat. Why? But there's a weapon here as well. Thanks, Rick. Coral. <laughs> I like how they pointed out that it was an Easter egg. Gee. Okay, I didn't know that. So what am I supposed to do? Just jump over these boats? These boats look like I'm supposed to jump over them, but I cannot jump that far. Well, what's that shadow? Hello? I'm seeing a shadow of a bird, but where's... Wait, where's the sun? We have arrived at the creative part of the game where you have to find a solution. Can I make a rope and swing it to one of those birds? <laughs> and then we can fly. Come bird, I will tame you. You will be my mount. This doesn't make any sense. Okay, that's where I was supposed to come from. After escaping the T-Rex somehow, which I just skipped by climbing over the mountain. So I guess this is where I'm supposed to go, then? It's the only thing that makes sense, I guess. Okay, there's lots of raptors, but I just found a revolver, so we're just going to... BAM! Whoa! That has a kickback, did you see that? Just... BAM! They just get blasted back. Now, if I would not miss so much, then I could actually use this gun for a while, maybe. To protect myself. You know what? I'm just going to kill dinosaurs to protect myself. And no longer for food, because food runs out in two seconds anyway. What's the point? Bam! 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 Wait. <gasps> Are you hearing that? I thought I just heard a voice, like a radio. It sounds like someone keeps saying John or something. <laughs> I don't know what it is. John. John. John, where are you? John. Oh, it is a radio! There we go. John. Someone over the radio respond. is saying John. So this guy John, must be John. Okay, John. so John died. John. Oh, rest in peace, right John. There. Hello? John? Uh, John's dead right now. Can I take a message? <laughs> what? Can I take a message? No. Why would I want to find these people, these crazy people? This guy is annoying though. The guy that I am playing, he's so annoying. Just constantly making just the most, the unfunniest jokes. Are you serious? Can I take a message? Oh my god. Okay, well, I guess this is the way to go then. At least I know that. Uh, I know the car won't start because no car works anymore. So we just got a lot of information. Apparently... It was in the year 2018 when I was in um, in the plane and it crashed because some eco-terrorists did something with, tried to do something with the weather um, and it didn't work. But it did bring my plane down, so apparently I was... What are you trying to do? I don't trust you. But it did bring my plane down. Uh, so apparently I was unconscious for two years, which doesn't make any sense at all and then the eco-terrorist did another thing what wait what there was another one yeah. oh, there was another one <laughs> and then the eco-terrorist did another attack and that one worked and it made the air toxic it made all of these plants grow really fast apparently that's the only way that there can be such old plants Within two years, because apparently right now is the year 2022, and the it's, the the apocalypse happened in the year 2020, so that's two years. That means that in two years there are trees that are a hundred years old, and the T-Rex, uh, how big it was! Whoa, whoa! Look, that's not two years old. Look at how big it is. That's more than two years old. How? How? And how can I walk around here if they all need to wear a gas mask? Because the guy that I saw before that got eaten by the T-Rex also wore a gas mask. 
So they all have to wear gas masks except me and I'm not dying. Or maybe that's why my food is running out so fast? Is that Could that in any way relate to each other or something? I don't actually know, I'm so confused. I think I need some time to think about this. Does that sound fair to you guys? I think up there is where I need to go, past the Brachiosaurus. I don't want to... Maybe it's a Bronto, I'm not really sure. Um, I think I need some time to think about this. Tell me in the comments what you guys think that the story is. And if it makes any sense to you guys. And tell me if you how, how unfunny it is, guys. It's, it's really bad. It is... Uh, I mean, are you serious with those jokes? Ah, uh, okay. Well, I will see you guys next week in another episode of Dinosis Survival. Um, apart from that, I hope you guys are having an awesome day. Don't forget to stomp like a dinosaur.